Hey guys, it's me Noah, and today I've got weekly update number three. Um, yeah, I haven't really been doing anything in the past few days. Um, I did actually film weekly update from today, the day that I actually filmed this weekly update, not the day I published it. Um, but I filmed weekly update number two a few days ago, so I, um, haven't really been doing anything but making this mock. It's, I'm not, probably not going to show you guys this in a video either, but, yeah. I was working on cutting Ahsoka's lightsaber blade smaller, so it'll be like in season three when she had, um, the two lightsaber blades. And they were both small, or one of them was small and one of them was for regular size blade. So I was trying to work on that, cutting it, but not very much success yet. I have to get a, a stronger knife, or a stronger blade to cut it. So here's, here's Ahsoka, Commander Cloud, and um, my Denal dude jumping out of the gunship when it's flying away. It had already delivered people from, like, back here. I just didn't put more base plates on. And then, this was the crash of my Republic Commando gunship. It had crash landed on here. It's got dirt pieces all around it. And, again, I've got my cool, awesome new backpack on my ARC Trooper. So, yeah, in case you didn't see my video on stairs, or my display stand thing, um, there it is. So, pretty cool, you should watch that video if you want to see how to make it. So, yeah, um, I do... Uh, with my ATAP in this, uh, obviously. Got my, um, Captain Dude. The guy that used to be an ARC Trooper, but then he got, dan his, he got his leg cut off by Ventress and stuff like that. Well, he got upgraded to an ARC, or to a Captain position. So he's now Captain. So, yeah. Um, actually the pilot I have in here is an ARC pilot, he's still in there, but, because I didn't have one running out, I just had the commandos running out, but, my cool custom gunship with miniguns, but those are the miniguns, those are the big Gatlins, it's got the hologram projector in it, missiles, everything, in case you haven't seen that, it's really cool, my custom, like, back sniper gun, just in case they see, like, a vulture droid, like a hundred yards behind them or something. Um, so yeah, this is the droid base thing. I tried to make the front door look cool. The gunship is kind of blocking the area, but then this is like where the droids come out of. They come from like a lower level, like underground, and they pop up right here through that door. See, obviously those two are coming out. And then this was, the top was another layer on there. Obviously it's black and it's burning. So I do have flames in there, but, yeah, so that was really all. I didn't put plants or anything in it, so I mean, I don't know, not really that compact. I did put my AT, or my AAT in it, I'm, you haven't seen that for a while, so I thought it would be pretty cool to put them in that. Yeah. So... And again, make sure you check out my cool display stand. It's really cool. I like it a lot. So, yeah. There's a whole view of it. You turn it to the side. Back here. I actually teach in, um, I show you guys how to make it to in uh, the video. So, it is pretty easy though. I mean, it's not really hard at all. Actually, to make it cooler, 
How about I add a Death Watch Sniper? There we go. Sniper! Yeah, so this is basically all to the mock. I did add those new mini guns on there, on my gunship, just to make it cooler. So, yeah, so this is all basically to, mock, to the mock. Not too much, really. Um, it didn't really, it didn't really take long either, so, yeah, and I am tomorrow going to my grandma's house, so I'm not going to be filming any videos for a while, and I might post one video while I'm at my grandma's house because I have Wi-Fi, so I might post it, because I can post the videos wirelessly, so, yeah, um, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.